The Dedicated X series aims to offer high-level explainer videos on data-related subjects in a way that's easily comprehensible for anyone. Our focus is on providing executive-level content that simplifies complex topics. In this video, we'll talk about the Data Lakehouse. The concept of a Data Lakehouse combines the strengths of data warehouses and data lakes, providing a unified platform for all types of data. Initially, data warehouses serve the purpose of storing structured data for business intelligence and reporting. However, the rise of big data introduced unstructured data, which posed challenges for data warehouses. Data lakes emerged as a solution to store raw, unstructured data, but they came with their own set of issues, such as data management and governance complexities. The Data Lakehouse architecture aims to bridge the gap between structured and unstructured data by combining the best features of data warehouses and data lakes. By leveraging the capabilities of a data lakehouse, organizations can access and utilize their data more effectively. The lakehouse allows for structured access to unstructured data, enabling quicker analysis and decision-making. It supports various use cases, including streaming, business intelligence, data science, and machine learning. So, what exactly is a data lake house? Well, let's use a superhero example to explain. Imagine Data Warehouse as a superhero who is great at organizing and analyzing structured data. It's like a master detective who knows how to solve puzzles with clear rules and patterns. Data Warehouse is perfect for tasks like business intelligence and reporting, where structured data is the main focus. Structured data refers to well-organized and formatted information that fits into predefined categories. It follows a consistent pattern and is typically arranged in tables or spreadsheets. For instance, sales data can be organized in a spreadsheet with columns for customer name, product name, quantity sold, price, and total sales. An employee database may have fields like employee ID, name, job title, department, and hire date organized in a table format. Financial statements such as balance sheets or income statements categorize data into sections like assets, liabilities, revenue, expenses, and net profit, enabling analysis and comparison. These examples highlight how structured data is neatly organized and can easily be processed for various purposes. On the other hand, Data Lake is like a shape-shifting hero who can handle all kinds of data, whether it's structured, unstructured, or even a bit messy. It's like a versatile spy who can adapt to any situation and gather information from various sources. Data Lake is great for capturing large volumes of data quickly and cost-effectively. Unstructured data refers to information that lacks a predefined format or organized structure. It cannot be easily organized into rows, columns, or fit neatly into a database. Examples of unstructured data include text documents like Word documents, PDFs, emails, and text files, which contain free-flowing text without a specific structure. Social media posts like Facebook posts, LinkedIn, Instagram, captions, and comments are also unstructured, often featuring a mix of text, hashtags, emojis, and media files. Additionally, unstructured data encompasses audio files like recordings or podcasts and video files such as meeting recordings, interviews, or event videos. These types of data lack a predefined structure and require specialized techniques for processing and analysis. Dealing with a mix of structured and unstructured data can be challenging, like solving different puzzles with scattered information. Data Warehouse and Data Lake, though powerful individually, struggle in this mixed data environment. That's where the Data Lake House comes in. It's the ultimate superhero team-up. It combines the strengths of Data Warehouse and Data Lake, creating a unified platform that solves structured and unstructured puzzles. With the Data Lake House, organizations access and analyze all their data in one place in a central command center. It enables finding insights, making informed decisions, and adapting to changes in the data landscape. So, what are some of the challenges? Well, implementing a data lake house presents challenges. Data governance and quality are crucial to prevent the data lake house from becoming something called a data swamp with duplicate or incomplete data. Query performance can be an issue as well, requiring optimization to handle complex analytical queries. Additionally, organizations need proper planning and coordination to ensure effective data management, tool selection, and data governance processes. 
Implementing a data lighthouse requires careful planning, defining data management rules, selecting tools, and ensuring data quality and governance. Once implemented successfully, the data lighthouse empowers organizations to maximize their data's potential. The future is promising for the data lighthouse as its unified approach to data management and analysis continues to improve organizations with insights, agility, and the ability to harness the full potential of their data. As the data lakehouse evolves and becomes increasingly complex, the data lakehouse stands as a powerful solution, driving innovation and enabling organizations to thrive in the data-driven era.